Hey everyone, I'm Ellen here at eTrailer.com. Today we're taking a quick look at the plastic sink strainer with Pop Stop Stopper. So this is going to be a replacement for your RV's sink, whether that's in the bathroom or maybe in your shower. That pop-up stopper is going to be where we can open that up, let the water flow through. If we want to fill our basin or our tub, we can just pop that closed and it should keep out most of the water. Now there's no rubber gasket or anything to really seal that up. It's just plastic on plastic. So there honestly might be some water that seeps through the crack there. I would think that it probably would just be kind of a slow drain. So something to keep in mind there. It is made out of a plastic construction overall, which is pretty typical for our RV parts. There are some available here at eachother.com that are made of metal if you'd prefer but it's kind of up to you there. The advantage with plastic is that you never have to worry about rust, but tends to not be as long lasting. So kind of some pros and cons for you. It does have a nice chrome finish. So looks pretty nice. Comes with the lock ring or lock nut and also a foam gasket to keep the water from seeping underneath the drain itself. As far as measurements, this is going to fit a two inch drain opening and it has about a 1 and 7 8 inch diameter. Our ring here says that it's a 1 and a half inch diameter so that's going to be to the inside of the threads. If we look at the length of the threads that we have to work with it's about 1 and a quarter inch. The stopper when it's all the way pushed in it's going to make our length more like 1 and 5 8 inches or actually 1 about about one and three quarters of an inch. The outside diameter of the top of our drain is about two and three quarter inches. That's about all there is to it for our plastic sink strainer with pop stop stopper. If you need any other accessories for your RV, we do have a lot of options available. There's also a replacement part for the stopper itself, so if, that's ever, if that ever gets broken or damaged, you can just replace that part out without having to replace the whole thing. But that's it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.